Hey guys, Kenny from Magic Internet Money. In today's video, we're going to be talking about Kevin O'Leary, Mr. Wonderful, and his inability to say that Sam Bankman Freed was a fraudster. Now, is this the th a uh, point of personal pride, uh, basically where he basically said Sam was a good guy, doesn't think uh, Sam did anything wrong and that he would invest with him again. He just can't go back on those words. I don't know. We're going to watch this interview in one second. Okay, so just to set the background, this is Coindesk TV. Uh, Kevin O'Leary is talking about the uh, Sam Bankman free trial. Uh, one of the, you see in the title there up top, it says all the crypto cowboys will be gone. Uh, talking about not really Sam Bankman Freed because Sam Bankman Freed is a good guy, uh, but CZ out of Binance. Um, and as this interview goes on, basically the gist of this whole interview is Kevin O'Leary saying that, you know what, Bitcoin's kind of at a stalemate right now. Reason being is that institutional investment is not there. And the reason for that is there's no exchange to have this institu institutional investment. Uh, when you look at all these ETFs, uh, BlackRock's going to have ETFs, whoever's going to have an ETF. Well, you need a place to store, like to have this ETF. Uh, is it going to be Coinbase? The Kevin O'Leary touches on that and says, no, it's not going to be Coinbase because Coinbase is going through litigation. The SEC keeps on just suing them and suing them. So why would you put your ETF on Coinbase when the SEC keeps on going after Coinbase? It does not make sense. So he says that needs to be settled first. Uh, and then basically it looks like Kevin kind of puts puts in a pitch for a new exchange that's going to be out of the Middle East called M2 or something like that. I guess that's Kevin's new, uh, new exchange that he's going to invest in. Um, but then they go back to the whole Sam Bankman Freed thing and basically... Kevin could not just say, you know what, Sam basically scammed everybody, he was wrong, I was wrong about him. No, he had a blame on CZ, and I'll let you listen to that yourself. In the whole FTX thing, it's been out there for over a year, pretty well everybody knows what happened. This behemoth uh, contest between CZ and Sam Bankman Freed, you have to hand it to CZ, he won. He basically bankrupted FTX with that jam down of 550 million in FTT tokens that week in November. Everybody knows that story. And now the recovery phase is starting, allegedly over 7 billion recovered, but who knows yet? And all this litigation that's floating around. So here you have it. So basically he says that CZ bankrupt Sam Bankman Freed by selling off all that FTT token, but what he forgets to hit on is all the stuff that was going through Alameda, all the stuff that they confessed to about in the ins kind of like the insider trading, inflating tokens like Solana, the FTT token itself, the fact that they were intermingling customer funds and that the funds were being used uh, to pay or to give out loans to Alameda that they used to investigate without any stop losses, all that stuff. It wasn't CZ just selling off. 500 million worth of FTT tokens. Yes, that would have been hard to deal with, but if all your books were in order, no, you, this wouldn't all be, and Sam Bankman Freed wouldn't be on charges for all this stuff, for fraud and all that. No, but Kevin will not give up on the fact, he will not admit that Sam Bankman Freed was wrong and not admit that he was wrong about him because Kevin at the start when this all happened stood up for Sam Bankman Freed and said, no, he's a good guy. This is not what's happening. I'd invest with him again. And he just keeps on continuing to echo that. Um, I liked Kevin O'Leary, but I wish you'd just give this up. Uh, basically, I can't trust him for anything else. This M2 thing in the Middle East, we'll see what comes of that. Uh, he says it's going to be a regulated exchange. But what are your thoughts on Kevin O'Leary? What are your thoughts on Sam Bankman Freed? What are your thoughts on CZ? Do you think CZ is CZ the fault that you lost your money with FTX? Anyway, leave comments down below, like, and subscribe. We'll see you on the next one.